everyone, my name is Ariel. I am from Alberta, Canada. I'm a restaurant manager and a fundus agent, but I choose to run my own digital business and stay at home with my kids. I'm Jared. I come from the construction industry. I used to work in the oil patch on service rigs for eight years, and I also worked in construction. I worked in new home construction for over 15 years. And I used to work in insurance as an insurance broker. I was an insurance agent, flight attendant, server. I'm now 45. Working all and you know, I miss a lot of the quality time with my daughter and my family and my friends because I was always working. A few years ago, we were on a road trip and we decided that we needed to make a change in life. That's right, life is short and if you haven't figured that out yet, you will soon. After many very necessary lessons learned, I began to discover the power and leverage behind global online marketing. I came across this opportunity, this 90% done for you system. I think it was probably four months ago and I, I mean, I really haven't looked back. This has brought me to a whole new level of thinking and living. I can breathe again and I can see my dreams within reach. And thanks to the guidance and the lessons from some of the best experts in the industry, I've been able to create my own personal empire and economy. What I love most about this business is you don't have to sell anything. You're literally going to be opening a door of opportunity for other people. We wake up every morning excited to see what has happened overnight with our business. And when I saw this, it was it was really, I felt like I was in the right place at, at the right time. The genuine support and energy in this team is amazing. The best thing about this opportunity is that I can do it while still at my day-to-day -day job. This has been the best decision I have made. Every day we celebrate successes from tiny ones to the giant leaps. Now I know I'm well on my way to making my dreams come true. And I am so excited for my future and my family's future as well. Now I'm able to see my son do the things I want in my life. It isn't solely just about making money, but rather about networking with like-minded people. I have met some of the most wonderful human beings I have met in a long time. We did it for our family. And it worked out very well. <laughs> and it worked out incredibly. Today, after the few months that we've been doing this, we're happier than we've ever been before, and our goals and our dreams has started to become a reality rather than just wishes. I would recommend anyone looking to do the same to give this a try. It definitely works. I get to live life on my terms and I'm available for my kids 24 hours a day, seven days a week. It truly does not get any better than that. It's not a matter of if this is going to work for you. It's just a matter of how big, how fast. Hashtag relate, you love the snow, but not the snowstorm, eh? <laughs> exactly three years ago, on the same day, having no choice to survive, I was faced with lots of obstacles and challenges, just like this. Videos of myself forced to walk in a snowstorm just to get to work. The struggle is real. This old videos reminds me on how thankful, grateful, and blessed I am today for being able to stay home and spend more time with my beautiful family. And that is all because of God's grace in blessing me to become a digital business owner. Becoming a digital business entrepreneur is one of my biggest lifesavers. My name is Ariel. I am from Alberta, Canada. Happy everyone, my name is Ariel and I am from Alberta, Canada. I'm a mother, I'm a wife, and I am a digital entrepreneur. So why I choose to become a digital entrepreneur? Oh, first, um, if you're a digital entrepreneur, it's very easy to run your business because you can do it anytime and anywhere that you like as long as you have your phone, your iPad, your Android phone, smartphone, um, laptop and you have the internet connection you can run your business okay and then at the same time um, um, I choose to be an online entrepreneur because um, 
there's a lot of possibilities there's a lot of opportunities because you know the internet is very broad and there's lots lots of um, opportunities um, on your way because as a digital entrepreneur it's not just a small scale but it's um like worldwide so anywhere as long as they're connected to the internet as long as they can see you they can reach you you can do business with them and i think that's it for now thank you and have a wonderful day bye Right, and happy everyone it's me again Ariel so they're asking me um, how hard to become a digital entrepreneur my answer is it's not hard actually you know what because you have a step-by-step uh, -step training that you can actually go back and forth if you like if you want to refresh something um, and then um, you have the you have your coach that will help you all throughout your um, all throughout your training and at the same time you also have your support group we are actually like 29,000 uh, in our community that um, that is willing to help you once you ask you ask them and then at the same time um, it's very easy because everything is um, everything it's already there like all you have to do is just to follow the, the training and then do your job like do what is the task for you and then um and just be passionate about it and then be confident and then trust the system trust the process everything will go and actually the actually um the result will really 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 surprise you because it's very amazing it's very amazing it's very promising um to become a digital entrepreneur uh how i wish i can show it to you guys but right now um this is the only information that i can provide so if you want to know more information about being a digital entrepreneur um feel free to message me i can um i can give you more information about it and of course it's for free so you, there's no cost for all the information and we also have a webinar like a a workshop that you can also check on I uh, just register your name and then you can have your spot there so you can watch our free live webinar live workshop there and then you can see lots of successful people doing the digital entrepreneur and I think that's it for now thank you and have a great day bye and happy everyone it's me Ariel so they're asking me what is the difference between a traditional business and a digital business digital entrepreneur so there's a big difference um, in putting up your um, traditional business um, because number one you have to do planning right because you have to check five to ten years from now what is the business you're going to be okay but in digital business um, you can see like some of the most of the people there in the community like six months to one year or two months two years you can see how their life change when it comes to digital business you can see that as long as you're passionate about it as long as you do your job as a digital entrepreneur and of course as long as you follow the training okay and then if you're doing a traditional business you have to do your um, of course, you have to do your research, you have to do your survey, everything because because you have to check your target market, right? So you have to do surveys of um, of the people nearby. If it's if your target is family, so you have to do your uh, survey, like you know. And then, but in traditional business, uh, in digital entrepreneur, digital business, you don't have to because everything is on the internet. If you want to target specific um, specific people, specific place location right you can easily um you know the internet give you lots lots of opportunities so it's very easy the best marketing right now is in the internet especially on facebook so everything is on the internet it's very easy they okay, compare to traditional business but it's um it's just my opinion okay and then 
the third in when it comes to stopping and recruiting so you don't have to um, when it comes to finding people to work in your company um, you do staffing, recruiting, interviews, everything, blah 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 but in a digital business you don't have to why? because all you have to do is to train yourself because you are the one who is doing the business you are the owner so you can do it by yourself you don't have any staff to do it for you okay? so if you want to yes, if you want to um, make your business big so you have to work hard for it by yourself so and then yeah so you have to disregard those interviews staffing and recruiting and then next is quality assurance so quality assurance because you have to check what are you gonna sell what you're planning to sell right so you have the product test test of products specific product but in the digital business you don't have to you should skip that okay in traditional business um of course you have to have a product right so like for example if you have like 50 items like 50 different products of course you have to have like um like 30 or 50 or 100 pieces of each and then since you're just starting you have to wait for a week or a month before you see what which product is saleable and which product is not so in digital business you don't have to no inventories you don't actually need to stock up a product or anything okay and then equipment that you're gonna maintenance and equipment so you don't have to because all you have to do is have your iphone your smartphone android phone iphone laptop computer internet connection and everything will go your business will run okay you don't need anything like you don't have any big equipment and then next is investment so of course investment there's a big investment when it comes to traditional business you know because it's literally like if you're planning to do a traditional business you have to like go loan in the bank and then build up your store and everything blah 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 you have to put up equipment you have you have big money you need to have a big money to become to put up your traditional business but in digital business you don't have to okay so instead of uh, instead of paying for extra for doing a recruitment product testing in digital business you don't have to okay just have to invest of course you have to invest because business is not business if there's no money involved so i will i will do a separate video about the investment okay and then what else what else i think i think that's for now so uh if you want to know more about the the digital entrepreneur if you want to learn more about the digital business feel free to message me i can actually help you i will help you Thank you and have a great day. Bye.